Welcome to the Telium Challenger series. Today we're going to be going over dynamically configuring the Adobe Analytics Report Suite. This is a continuation of our previous Challenger video of configuring Adobe Analytics. My name is Jason Paddock and I'm the manager of the Deployment Engineering Team for the US and Asia Pacific. We will utilize TIQ to simplify vendor configurations. Our solution will entail configuring a lookup table extension, adding a new data variable, and then mapping this new variable to the Adobe tag. So let's get started. So our two sites that we're going to play with today is our Magento 1 instance as well as our Magento 2 instance here. And so when I load Magento 1, I want to load Report Suite A. When I load Magento 2, I want to load Report Suite B. So let's go inside of TIQ, click on the Extensions tab, click on Add Extension, select Lookup Table, give it a friendly title. configure Adobe Analytics Report Suite. We're going to use the value of our domain to know which site we're on. And we need to create a new variable. So we'll click on the plus sign here, say Adobe Analytics Report Suites, and hit Apply. Now our first store is magento.deploytelium.com. And when this is the case, I want to load this report suite. And when I'm on my new store, I want to load a test suite. Now, this is all we need to do for our lookup table. Of course, we can continue to add new entries based on our needs. We'll jump over to our tag now, Adobe Analytics tag, go to the map variable section, click on edit. We're going to find our new variable that we just created, the Adobe Analytics report suite variable. Click on select destination and then map this to our S underscore account. This is the report suite override. Hit close, apply, and now we can go ahead and publish this out. So we'll say testing Adobe, and we'll just push this out to our dev and QA environments for now, and hit publish. Now that our publish has succeeded, let's go ahead and go back to our sites. And so our Magento 1 site, we'll just go ahead and refresh this to pull in the latest Telium configuration. Open up our Adobe Debugger, and we can see our report suite ID is telium jsonp which is exactly what we were looking for. And then when we go to our Magento 2 instance and refresh that one, look at the Adobe Debugger, and here we see our Telium test jsonp This concludes our Telium challenge. If you have any other challenges that you would like, please submit them at telium.com forward slash challenge. Thank you.